It's not necessarily like this part of the body because this part of the body is actually clean. It's just this one little specific spot um, that's like right above his butt that like really reeks really bad and that's why we're showering him right now. Hey, what's going on heroes? Welcome back to the vlog. So check out these beautiful little princesses right here. Nice, cute, beautiful dresses. I don't know why they decided to wear a dress today, especially considering that it's all sad and gloomy and cold and outside. But nope, they decided to wear some cute dresses. Mamas, what is yours? Princess Anna? And, and she even got the little crown right and there. The and what's Anna. yours, Mamas? Anna. Just a beautiful dress, that's it? Yeah. Why did you decide to wear a dress today? Because I wanted to. Just because you wanted to? That's the same reason she wanted to. All right, so right now I'm on my way to go drop him off at school. Later on today, Emma does have a parent-teacher conference, which I'm really not looking forward to. Uh, but she has been doing good. She has been getting good report, but it's always stressful having to go see the damn teacher and talk to him and find out everything that's been going good. And at the same time, your brain just happens to go towards the bad. So um, I'm really not looking forward to it, but it has to happen. Unfortunately, this little butt hair right here doesn't have to do hers until tomorrow. So that's just two days of stress. But anyways, like I said, I'm going to go drop off these beautiful princesses at school right now. Mamas, what kind of day are you going to have? A great, a great day. Pound it. <sighs> Emma, what kind of day are you going to have? Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Yeah, you're nervous because you're afraid of what they're going to tell us. How your teacher's going to be like, Emma's been misbehaving. She talks all the time. She no listen. She's going to get the pow pow. That's what you're afraid of? No. Well, here, jump it's out, crazy. ladies. Jump out. An awesome day. Remember, I'll see you after school, mamas, because you have your thing. All right, go, go, go. I decided to take a day off and um, actually come to the storage unit and get some work done because um, there's a lot of stuff that really needs to be thrown out because in the mix of trying to rush and get the hell out of the apartment, uh, we kind of just put through a whole bunch of stuff into the box without actually really paying attention. Oh crap, I forgot my keys. There's no way that I'm actually even be able to get into the unit. <laughs> But like I was saying, in the mix of um, trying to get all this stuff into boxes and just get the hell out of the apartment um, as fast as possible, we kind of just threw so much stuff into the boxes that we should have been throwing out. Like the last time I was here, I, I was able to organize this whole section and just like make room because a lot of the important stuff that I actually need to get to is way back there in that corner. So little by little, I need to start shifting everything towards the door so that I can actually get back there. And that's why I decided to take the day off because I need to start going through this. If I could get rid of enough stuff that we actually don't even need and we're just storing um, for no reason then I'm definitely gonna switch this over to a smaller unit like these right here I think we're just gonna go ahead and get rid of these and as far as the um the ACs right there I think I'm just gonna go ahead and donate those because there's no we don't need those anymore this too like this microwave right here is still good don't get me wrong those are still really good this is still really good but I think at this point we really don't need them and wherever we move to um, we're definitely gonna make sure that they have um, central AC but you know stuff like that but like I said little by little I'm gonna start shifting all this over here to this section whatever i deem is unnecessary and needs to be thrown out that's why i have the cart right there man i think i made it worse i i was trying to move everything out of the way i was trying to clear out some of these damn boxes um which inadvertently were like half empty so there's no reason why they would be taking up this much space um i mean i did clear this section now i don't know how i feel about the sofa i don't know if i just want to go ahead and take that out or what um this over here like all the new beds and everything and the new furniture um that we have bought right before we moved out that's what they're still in boxes there's the new bed um, so all this is basically just going to stay in this corner. I just got to really cramp it into that corner where it's not leaning like this. Um, because the more that I shift these things, the more this is just going to come forward. Um, but it's moving along. It's just, you know, it has to get worse before it gets better. Um, as far as cleaning goes, I, I you know, life does that too. But um, hopefully not in this situation. I just got to, um, I got to maneuver this. But I also have to go to um, Emma's, what is this, uh, parent-teacher conference. So I, I probably have like an hour left. Hey, little princess. Hey, little princess. You had an awesome day? Oh, be careful, mama, you're gonna drop your money. You're not Princess Anna, you're Princess Elsa? 
I think got nothing from the book fair. Okay, well, let's go get Emma. Come on, okay. come on, Princess Cut Elsa. Cut let's go get Cut Emma. Cut. You have the acting class, but yeah. you also have your parents' teacher conference. Well, go, yeah, go, go, go before they close it then. Go, 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 go. He said we don't have to go. You don't have to be there? Yeah, he Bro. said I'm able to go to acting class. Okay. Well, don't you mean just play board games class? Well, we're acting. And there's some subscribers behind well, you. Well, I'm acting like I care <laughs> right now. Okay, well, I gotta turn this off because I don't want to get in trouble again. I'm not even supposed to be vlogging in the school because I've gotten in trouble before. But one of the main complaints is that other people's kids didn't want to be in the in the background somewhere. So as you guys can see, there's no there's no kids in the background. But um, obviously, I'm not gonna vlog while I'm in there talking to the teacher. How much you gonna listen, right? Look, there he is. That honestly went a lot better than I thought it was going to. Um, she's doing really good when it comes to reading. Um, as far as like comprehension, she can read most of the words, like 99% of the words um, that they put her to read, she can definitely read them. Um, as far as the comprehension, everything that she read is really good. The problem that we're having is in the literature side. Um, the comprehension on the literature side, which is like the smart stuff, you know, um, reading as far as history and science and stuff like that, that's where she's having trouble um, verbalizing what she just read. But when it comes to like the the fun stuff you know regular books and anime she can definitely recite everything that she just read she can write it down no problem so that part is really good the, uh, the part that she is struggling with is math and I don't blame her because I struggle helping her I'm um, trying to do that new age math as well so much so that we end up having to ask Google or Gemini to help us because like I said I struggle with math myself and then this new age math is beyond me um, but overall she did pretty damn good right now she ended up staying at the after school program because she does have that um, the directing and art program that she mentioned um so she is going to stay there a little bit later but clementine and i are not going to just sit there all day long waiting for her so we just came over here to this poo -poo seria to sit down and eat Gracias. how much do you know what you want to drink you want horchata couldn't care less you just want pupusas huh okay bro this looks so good right here those pupusas y platanos definitely getting that and you said you want two cheese Okay. Yeah, you get two cheese, and I'm gonna get this one right here. Did you wanna Did you wanna share those or no? Okay. Be careful, you don't burn your mouth. Okay. Blow it. You have to blow it so you don't burn your mouth. They're good, huh? Yeah, they are. Like the cheese babusa. I'm not trying to get my dress dirty. Okay. All right, we'll catch up with you guys after because we're gonna stay here. We're gonna enjoy this nice meal. Um, I got two bean pupusas right here, some platano. We got some fries right here. Clementine got two cheese pupusas. Oh yeah, we're gonna sit here, we're gonna enjoy this meal, and then we're gonna go pick up um, Emma from her after school program after. Come on, mamas, get in. Blame your mom, okay? Blame your mom. She told me four o'clock. I told her that. Did you have fun at your after school program? Yes. What did you do? Did um, you do some real acting today? Yes. Did you though? Show me what you learned. Show me, come on. Act your heart out. No. Uh-huh, you learned nothing. And they gave us some really bad news about you. Mama they said, said they that Mr. Maldonado said good things about me. Oh, damn, she, your mom ruins everything, huh? She made me come late because she told me the wrong time 30 minutes later. It's a good thing that I texted you and asked you what time because your mom had told me 30 minutes later. And now I'm over here trying to prank you saying that they gave us bad news. And she goes, no, they gave us nothing but good news. Ruins everything. Here, I got you some pupusas. There's and fries. One of them is hers, so um, you can have the other one, okay? All right, when we get home, you guys already know how this routine goes. The girls are going to sit down, they're going to do their homework, then they're going to be able to relax for a little bit. Emma does have to practice her violin, so um, I'm just going to go ahead and skip all of that, and we'll catch up with you guys after. For the last few days, Biscuit's order has been getting worse and worse. Ever since I took him to the um, to the beach with me, he's been getting worse and worse. And today is finally the day that I'm going to shower him. I already showered little Lacey over there. And you guys can see, look at her. Looking all sad. Yes, take her inside, okay? Because it's a little bit cold in here. Make sure she's really dry and then come back because you got to help me dry this little, this little fat head right here. You ready, bro? I know you're not. I know you're not. As much as he loves water, he really doesn't like showering um, too much because I honestly because I think the water hose is just really cold for him. Um, but we gotta do it. Come on, biscuit. You stink like hell, so we gotta shower. Come on. Sit, biscuit. Sit. Good boy. No running. No running. There you are. Hey, hey. Well, you gotta hold him so he doesn't make a run for it, mamas. Mm -hmm, so dirty. Okay, he's dirty too. 
it's honestly mostly this little section right here you see around his tail because it sinks in right there and the tail is actually poking inward and that's where all the crumb and all the nastiness starts to gather it's not necessarily like this part of the body because this part of the body is actually clean it's just this one little specific this spot um that's like right above his butt that like really reeks really bad and that's why we're showering him right now yeah maybe if i just rub the booty a little bit this boy all about the butt You just shot word. Get your butt up. Get. You jerk. You jerk. You just shot word. Punk. The first thing you gonna do is roll everywhere and get dirty again. Bad kick it. Go take him inside. He's already dry. All right, you guys, we have come to the end of the vlog. Um, the dogs are already showered. We already put them in the house so that they can roll around and get extra dry and get cozy and stuff like that. I am going to give them some food right now in a little bit too because obviously they want some food after they got um, showered like that. I don't know why they do that. They just do. It's kind of like going to the pool and then after you're like really hungry and you just want to get some food. But anyways, um, I'm just going to go ahead and end this vlog because really not much is going to happen. You guys already know how the end of the day goes. So um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.